Before we all carried a portable GPS, before Google Maps, in fact, before maps themselves were even all that good, there was one device that we relied upon to help us find the way home, the compass. Are you ready to go searching for some facts? It's time for Al Connected's general knowledge. It all begins with this, a magnet. Simply put, a magnet is any object that creates a magnetic field. This field attracts ferromagnetic materials, such as iron, cobalt, and nickel. It also attracts and repels other magnets. Wait, attracts and repels? How can it do two opposite things at the same time? It's all about the poles. Every magnet has a north and south pole. Opposite poles, north and south, will attract, whereas the same pole on two different magnets, say south and south, will push away from one another. Now if all this talk of north and south poles is starting to sound a wee bit familiar, your suspicions are correct. The planet's core is in fact a giant magnet, and the planet is actually surrounded by a huge magnetic field. So, the planet's core is a magnet, magnets attract and repel one another. Can you guess what is at the center of this compass? Exactly, a magnet. In the end, a compass is simplicity itself. It is a magnet allowed to spin freely so that it can align itself to the Earth's magnetic field, thereby pointing out north, south, east, and west, and all points in between. Sure, a compass does become less accurate the closer you get to the poles, but there's a reason this elegant invention was so attractive to explorers for over a thousand years. It works. Hey, thanks for watching, and be sure to follow us so that you don't miss out on the next episode of Owl Connected's General Knowledge.